What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another one. It's finally warm enough for the GoPro to work. Let's get at it. First, we gotta pick out a slingshot. Hmm. Hmm. Eeny, meeny, miny, go. There's a moose in my trail. Move along, Mr. Moose. This damn moose is really committed to this trail. It's not even that heavily used. I'm post holing a little bit. She's ankle deep. Ugh. Haven't seen a rabbit yet. I'm blaming it on her. Get! That moose finally went off the trail. We're about half mile in. He just let me follow him at about, I don't know, 15 yards. Uh, or her, it's definitely a female. When I first saw it, I thought it was a, a, a young male with who had dropped his antlers already, which gave me hope for finding sheds today. But, nope, female. Anyhow, this beauty is what we're shooting. Time to get to work.
Really threaded the needle on that bad boy. Whoo! Yeah. That was a long stalk. <clears throat> but we got him. Oh, that's a nice one. Yes! <laughs> Look at that. Beautiful snowshoe hair. Put him right in the dome. Really threaded the needle. That was a super nice shot. I'm really, really pleased with myself after that. I hope that translates good on video, man. I had just a little teeny window where I could see his eye. And uh, I got him. I got him just below the eyeball. Oh, awesome. Awesome, awesome. I missed one earlier, clean miss. At about 15 yards, I shot right over the top of him. But yeah, all right. Let's see if we can't get another one. That'll be enough for today. Yeah, <laughs> I love it. That's threading the needle. That's awesome. Don't miss when you get the opportunity. They generally only give you one. <clears throat> There's a really fresh, like from this morning, a uh, set of coyote tracks, which is cool. Don't see a lot of coyotes here. There's too many wolves. Maybe the pack of wolves has moved out for a bit on the other end of their range. Anyway, we got a coyote, a coyote it looks like, just one. Thousands of miles of public land. Ah, <sighs> freedom. All right, we're back. Uh, we've got a beautiful snowshoe hair. That was a headshot. Threaded the needle on this one and hit the off switch. That's all you can ask for. Um, I had a clean miss on another one that was way closer and in the open. I shot about an inch over the top of it. I just misjudged the distance and ended up shooting right over the top. Uh, that rabbit is healthy and I'm sure very happy uh, that he didn't make it as a YouTube star. Um, <clears throat> today's kit, I know everybody asked about that. This is a slingshot I made out of scraps that came off of the uh, floor of my shop. Um, it's Birch Burl, Paduke, Purple Heart, and uh, G10. The bands are 0.72 burning skull um 25 to 20 taper or inch to three quarter inch taper depending on which system you use and a uh warrior leather pouch shooting 11 millimeter steel <clears throat> yeah um a lot of people ask uh, about where to shoot a rabbit headshots always win the day uh, you can get away with hitting them in the vitals here but it generally involves some tracking seeing as how they're snowshoe hairs and it's in the snow uh, as long as they're bleeding they're pretty easy to track down but they do you know run off on you whereas you hit them in the head you hit the off switch and it's lights out they they flop over feet kick and it's game over easy to find um probably more ethical it's food though so kill it and eat it uh I do want to take a minute to highlight um, some of the, the strategies that I used to get close to these rabbits. Uh, and this one in particular that I shot, I, I think I filmed like a three minute stalk. So I'm gonna go in and get this edited down and I'll show that whole stalk. And uh, if it's appropriate, I'll do a little voiceover and kind of point out what I'm doing. If you guys watch my last video where I'm just yapping, it's, um, I talk about like doing the lazy J walk to it, not staring directly at it and making more noise than you think you might need to. All those things came into play on this particular stock. So if it's not blatantly obvious, I'll do a voiceover. Oh yeah. See you on the next one. All right, so out the corner of my eye, um, I've seen some movement and it's on the ground 
and I saw like a little flash of yellow. Uh, and if you notice later in this clip, the bottoms of their feet are yellow, so I know there's a snowshoe hare here. I'm just kind of slowly walking, and as you can tell, like there's, it makes tons of noise. There's no going silently. So I'm just kind of meandering. Um, as you can see, I do turn my head a little bit to just kind of check and look for movement, those kind of things, uh, see if I can get eyes on them. <clears throat> and at this point, I don't see them. Um, but I do know that he's in the area. I know roughly, you know, what elevation he's at up on that hill. And I'm just kind of meandering, uh, side-eyeing, looking at the tracks. I can see his fresh tracks in the snow out of my peripheral vision. There, right in here, I can see him, <clears throat> and he sees me. So I take a couple of steps, and he he bounces, you know, three or four feet, uh, but he doesn't really take off. So I just kind of slowly walk in this J formation. See here, I start to kind of hook my J. I can see him at this point. I've got eyes on him, just a couple of ears back in some brush. I'm getting my slingshot ready now. Slingshots in hand and loaded know where he's at. I'm trying to close the distance. So I'm going to walk out, go around these bushes, and make a turn. And keep in mind, I'm not looking at him this whole time. I know where he's at. I don't need to stare at him. So I just slowly move through. So this is about the first point where I turn and look at him with my eyes. Uh, and as you can see, I've got a lot of head movement, and I just want it to appear like I'm scanning rather than staring right at him. Uh, that's a surefire way to scoop him, even when they're hidden in the brush like this. Slingshot comes up as soon as I've got him locked in. It's go time. Really threaded the needle on that bad boy. Whoo! Yeah. That was a long stalk. <clears throat> well, we got him. Oh, that's a nice one.